What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Seth the Line Surgeon. And um, I'm about to do a cold start on my Shindawa T344. This is actually my first cold start video. I don't really do cold start videos, but people always ask for them. So I'm gonna get the people what they want. So I'm gonna go ahead and start this. A little background about this. Like out of all my equipment, this is probably, yeah, this is probably the hardest thing to start. I won't say it's the hardest, but you gotta put the most effort into it. The easiest things, the easiest thing out of all my equipment to start probably is my, my Husky, my backpack blower. That thing starts on second pull every time. You don't even have to choke it. It's awesome. But once you get this bad boy going, mm, mm, mm. bad boy purrs like a kitten. So I'm gonna say I haven't started this all winter time. This is probably the only thing I haven't started this in my transformer. So go ahead and see what happens. Oh my God, can't wait till springtime. I love using that thing, but that thing is heavy. I'm gonna do a review on it. Um, I don't know, I'll probably do a review on it. I got nothing else to do, probably try to do that soon. But um, look out for that. Yeah, I might record it today. I'll post it later, but um, look out for the review on the Shadow T344. As y'all saw, a little hard to start. Like even, like most of my other weed eaters that I've used, like you can, um, the first time you start it up, it's kind of hard to start up. Then the rest of the day, it's like warm. You know what I mean? So you just grab it and go. This bad boy, it's gonna take you maybe two, three pulls, maybe four, every time you start it up. I don't know if it's cause the engine big or what. I don't know, but. Yeah, I don't know, but um, look out for that review. Thanks for watching. Comment, subscribe. Stay tuned. Yes, sir.